hay varios, vemos varios. Uh -huh. Hoy sí, good evening, Hello. good evening, teacher. Good evening, how are you? I'm fine. Okay, that's nice. Today you are going to be patient because I don't have uh, internet. <laughs> but I am I am using my cell phone actually. Oh wow. Yes, anyway. <laughs> so maybe you're going to hear me kind of um a, sometimes maybe you're not gonna hear me. <laughs> okay. So, how are you? Oh, tranquilo, teacher. Oh, Everything relax. good? Relax. Relax. En okay. Lo que, en lo que cabe, ¿no? Okay, that's nice. Okay, Milagro, how are you? So far, so good, sir. Okay, that's nice. Very good. And tell me, what do you remember about yesterday's class? Any of you? Uh -huh. Yesterday we were we were studying about adverbs and morals. Okay, adverbs and, and morals, right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And we were uh, talking about the words that we can use for permission, obligation. Mm -hmm. Yes. Or prohibition. Excellent. Prohibition too, right? Okay. Yes. And also, I need to share. Uh, Thank you, thank you so much. I'm gonna share the agenda with you. Uh, today we are not gonna use the breakout rooms because creo que si lo usamos, pues no. Okay, uh, si lo usamos, este, ¿cómo se llama? Este, creo que se nos va a cortar la llamada. Okay, so here you have the agenda for today. I'm gonna skip the general information in the. So we have a degree in the welcome instructions, the review, the warm up. It, uh, in a warm up, we have a jeopardy. A jeopardy is a game uh, for winning points. Okay, the jeopardy. And also we have uh, attendance, the snapshot, the conversation, grammar focus. We have a vocabulary, new vocabulary that I sent to the WhatsApp group. And grammar focus, platform exercise, the models review as an adverse review and the feedback, right? So uh, for the objectives for today, so participants will be able to review the last session and ask questions about uh, the last class. In the second one, participants will be able to discuss the questions in Jeopardy as a warm up and read and practice and create a conversation based in a model. That was the homework for yesterday. And also you have uh, repeat some vocabulary expressions, complete some exercises in the platform and feedback, giving information about the last homework that was a TV show, right? Okay, that's nice. So we're gonna continue. So we're gonna start with the, uh, yesterday we were talking about these morals, right? So we have a uh, might, may, could, can, should, would, will, must, and have to. These are according with the uh, uh, how how um, they are stronger. So uh, I might have time. I'm not sure yet. Okay. So um, and we have a may that is more formal. I may go with you if I decide soon. Who I could bring my friends uh, if you like can. Uh, you have a cool that is more formal than can, right? I can come over later today. Should, I should probably leave tomorrow. Si se me escucha bien. Yes, yes sir. sir. Okay, okay, very good. Es que estoy con mis datos porque no hay internet desde mediodía, entonces eh, no hay, we don't have internet, so I, I have to use my cell phones. Yes, yes, I understand okay. and you're... Okay. Thank you. Okay, I uh, will. I will come, but I have to work. Uh, I will definitely be there lately today. I must remember to call them. I have to tell him to tell him. I have to tell him everything, right? So, um, uh, podríamos decir que desde el might, 
eh, hasta los más importantes serían must and have to, right? Esos son como casi una obligación moral hacerlos, ¿verdad? Porque no porque sea necesario, sino porque tienen que hacerlos. En cambio, can't is for ability, should is as a recommendation, will for future, cool is more formal, is more formal than can, and you have a may as a, a possibility, right? Okay, may and might, they both are as possibility. So uh, we're going to play the Jeopardy. Let me just change. Okay, so here you have the Jeopardy. In the Jeopardy, you have to choose, uh, can you see it? The numbers, 100, 200, 300, 400. Se ve, o no se ve? Oh. No, no yet. Okay, ahorita, permítanme. Okay, here we go. Now? Yeah, yeah. Okay, very good. So what you have to do, you have to choose a number. You have to choose a number and you are going to win points, right? So you're going to uh, win points uh, according with uh, the numbers you have. Okay, uh, vamos a ver, voy a tratar de arreglar la... Que no los veo muy bien. Okay, here we go. Uh, huh. Ah, okay. So, <laughs> okay. So, Juan David, we are going to uh, start with you. So, can you choose okay. a number, please? Excuse me, teacher. I, I... Okay. Choose a number. Choose one from obligation. So, you have a the, from obligation, prohibition, past, future, present, or mix. You have to choose one of a uh, number. 100? Uh -huh. Number. Yes, number. So you have to choose, uh, for example, 100, 200, 300, 400, 500 from obligation or prohibition, past, future, and so on. Okay, I'm going to send the instructions to the WhatsApp group. Okay, so uh, choose a number from one column, one column, okay? Look at the WhatsApp. Uh, so the instruction is there too. Se ve. Okay. Yes. Juan David. You have to choose one number. One number. Yes, teacher. Yeah, uh, I I want one hundred. One hundred in obligation, yeah. prohibition, or present. present. Okay, to present. Okay, for present. Yes, present. Okay, so. For this one, uh, let me see. Let me see, let me see. Better. Okay. So for this one, uh, let's see the question. Okay. So you have the sentences, you have to choose the two options. So you play football <laughs> in the living room. Sorry, I promise not to break anything. So what do you think is the answer here? Do. Do? Auxiliary do. Auxiliary do. Okay. Okay. So, uh, do you play? So if it is present, so it must, you, you, can, you can use do, right? If it is present. But according with the answer is a must. Okay. So the answer is must you play football in the living room? So, yeah, okay. So we're going to come back to the menu. Okay. So, uh, Milagro, can you choose a number? Sure. Um, uh, 200 for, from obligation, please. Okay. Solo responde Alejandro. Okay. okay. Obligation, right? Yeah, obligation. Yeah, yeah. 100. No, 200, please. Okay, 200. Uh-huh. This is going to be boys versus girls. Okay, the question is why he stay at home every weekend? Because he to work in his father's shop. Mm, why has why ha uh, uh, no? Hmm? Obligation you use have. Okay, uh huh. But for the question for have, 
if you why ¿Cómo hacemos la pregunta con have to? Why? Ajá. Yes, Patricia. Patricia le está soplando. No, 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 no. no. Sorry. I was thinking ah, okay. in love voice. In love voice. Uh, ok. Ah, ok. Ok, José Alejandro. José, no, José. Uh, ok, José Alejandro. En, sí. Ok, Carlos José Asensio. No problem. Uh -huh, so uh, the possible answers, se puede equivocar. Um, I'm not sure, teacher. It's okay. It's okay. No problem. Can be hot or hot. Ok, pero para la pregunta con have. Ok. Does. Ajá. Ok. ¿En the other space? Because she has to work. Ok, let's check it out. It has to. Ok. Mas en has, has, right? Why must he stay at home every oh. weekend? Because he has to work in his father's shop. It's okay, no problem. Oh. It's okay. So uh, another, uh, I need a, another person. Okay. Who else? Barones son poco, verdad? Ahora que lo pienso. Jose Alejandro is working. So uh, let's see. Uh, Patricia Margarita Castellanos. Okay. Let me see. <clears throat> How about uh, and past future and 300. Okay, okay, okay. Past oh, future, oh, oh. 300, 300. Yes. Okay, 300 for past future. Okay, the question is, all the kids blank help with the housework. When their mother broke her arms, they learned to cook and look after their baby sister. Look after, cuidar, verdad? Look after. All the kids. Esta no es pregunta, es oración. Es... Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Um, the kid must help with the household housework when their mother broke her arms. They. Aquí, ajá. Uh -huh. Oh, they has to learn to cook and look after their babysitter. Okay. Sister, sorry. All okay. the have to and had to, had to. Okay. This is oh, have it's, to it's past. Because it's, it's past, past, right? Okay. It's yes, because it's past. But it's okay. Don't worry. It's okay. Okay. So thank you so much. Uh, another person. Two more volunteers. Okay. Let me see who. Stephanie Sarai. Hello, Stephanie. Yes, teacher. Okay, can you choose one? Um, um, two hundred for what? Prohibition. Prohibition. Okay, now the question is My brother go to the cancer last night, as that grounded him because of his terrible marks. Recuerde que es prohibition, right? Es prohibición. Uh -huh. Puede equivocarse, no hay problema. No problem if you make mistakes. Mm. Yes. I'm sure, sure. Uh, uh, yes, you can say uh, cualquier modal puede utilizar, no hay problema. Pero recuerde que es prohibición, está eh, se está prohibiendo. Mustn't. Okay, mustn't. Let's check it out. And. Okay. 
is couldn't. My brother couldn't go to the concert last night as that grounded him because of his terrible marks. Okay, it's okay. Dando ni una. No estoy dando ni una, teacher. <laughs> Está difícil, va. Okay, vamos sí. a la última. Okay. Esto no me si... suena que, que, que damos la, la, la respuesta y al final no está complicado, teacher. <laughs> Verdad. Okay, vamos a ver. Eh, Geraldine, do you want to play? Sí. Yes. Okay. Obligation, prohibition. Eh, prohibition number 400. 400, okay. Let's check it out. Okay, so. <clears throat> Es prohibición, ¿verdad? I'm sorry you must leave your cameras in the past because you take photos in the cathedral. Let me see, let me see. Yes, for prohibition. ¿Cuáles serían los modales por prohibición? Ayúdenme. Mustn't. Can't. Are. are Mustn't. Uh -huh. Mustn't or... You must leave your cameras in the bus because you, you mustn't take photos. You could take photos. I'm sorry, you must leave your cameras in the bus because you, you mustn't take photos in the cathedral. Cathedral, in the cathedral, right? In the bus, in the bus, okay? Mm -hmm. So, yes, Masen. Okay, very good. Nice, excellent. Ya ven que juntos sí lo pudieron lograr. Okay, that's nice. Una, una al final, una al final. Sacó la cara por nosotros, Gerald. Okay. For the girls. For the girls. Yes. Ah, for the girls, no for the boys. Bueno, por por nosotros. Por nosotros. Por nosotros. Me autopercibo, me autopercibo ahorita. Okay. Hay poquitos varones hoy. You said that boys versus girls. You said that boys versus girls. <laughs> yes, all I said right, that. all right. Okay. Yes, but I forgot the barone. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna continue with with the with the class. <laughs> okay. So uh, I remember that you have a uh, homework. Okay. <laughs> and the homework was to create a conversation, right? A uh, conversation similar, y no la veo, similar, similar to, it's the PDF, right? PDF, where are you, PDF? Mm. Okay, here we go, the PDF. Uh, me va a tener un poquito de paciencia porque, okay. No problem, teacher, no problem, yeah. I understand you. Okay. Yes. Yes, because uh well it's not the same as the as if I had Wi-Fi. <laughs> so let me see. Okay, okay. Ahora me quiero mover al otro PDF, pero no, no se quita la. <laughs> Espérame, permítame. Okay, let me see. This one. Can you see it? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh yeah. yes, I I'm Yes, okay, so we have uh, uh, the ways to say you are sick. I don't feel well. I don't feel well. La de porque, eh, una como R, porque está entre dos vocales. I feel terrible. I don't feel so good. Aquí, ¿verdad? In, in the first one. And also, so you have a, um, what's wrong? You can say I have a toothache. I have a bath cake. ¿Cuál, another ailments, do you remember? ¿Cuáles other ailments you remember? Uh, stomach ache. Uh-huh, yes, a stomach ache. Um, toothache. A toothache, toothache, okay, of uh, the teeth. Uh-huh, a backache, a toothache. What about, how do you say, gripe or resfriado? Uh, runny nose or... You have a runny or nose. Flu? The flu? flu, the flu es la gripe. Yes. And the cold, yes. el resfriado, ¿verdad? Se oh, parece. Heart attack. Yes. Okay. Heart attack. Oh, my gosh. Heart, heart attack. attack. Okay. okay. <laughs> so, you can... Okay, so another idea is it will be like a should or shouldn't, right? You should go to bed. You shouldn't go to class. You should take a nap. You should... Uh, you shouldn't exercise or you should exercise, right? Yes. And some remedies. I remember that some remedies... 
are a, take something, right? You should take something. You should lie down. Este es recostarse. You should lie down. You should have some tea. You should see a doctor. You should see a dentist. Okay, take something, lie down, have some tea, see a doctor, see a dentist. Okay, so who is going to start? <laughs> hey, teacher. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay. Uh, I feel terrible. What's wrong? I have a strong backache. Oh, that's too bad. You okay. really have to lie down. Mm -hmm. Good idea. Thanks. I Thanks. hope you feel better. Excellent. Nice pronunciation. Very good. I like. Uh, you said a uh, good idea, right? Good idea because you have the letter D between two vowels. Nice. That's nice. Very nice pronunciation. Okay. Somebody else. Somebody else. Somebody else. Uh huh. Vamos a escoger entonces a alguien. <laughs> okay, Geraldine. Thank you, Geraldine. I don't feel well. What's wrong? I have a headache. Oh, that's too bad. You really should take something. Good idea. Thanks. I hope you feel better. Okay. Thank you, Geraldine. Thank you. Okay. I don't feel, right? Como la de entre dos vocales, I don't feel well. A uh, good idea, right? Good idea. Excellent. Nice. Very good. Okay. Another person. Aquí me sale Carlos José Asensio, pero creo que el for the blizzard, he has some problems for the blizzard, I think. Okay. That's nice. Uh, Lucia Elena, are you available to talk? Lucia Elena? Hello? Hello, Lucy. No, I creo que me pidió. I don't know if she asked for permission today. Hello, Lucia. Another no, person? Señor. Okay. Juan David, ¿será que usted puede? Okay. Uh, maybe Juan David? No, 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 no yet, pude no hacer yet. la tarea, teacher. Yo okay. Soy, no, It's soy okay. honesto, no lo podía hacer. Este, okay. Sí. And what about Lucia? Lucia is I not in the meeting. Improvise. <laughs> yes, it's okay. Try to do it. Okay, what about uh Mira, qué malo que se le hace. Margarita Vigail Tobías. Hello, Margarita. Hello, hello. Ah, hey, Stephanie. Sure. Okay, Stephanie. <laughs> okay, I don't feel so good. What's uh -huh. wrong? I have earache. Oh, that's too bad. You really should see a doctor. Mm -hmm. Good idea. Thanks. I hope you feel better. Okay, nice. Excellent. Very good. Okay, what about you? Uh, who else? Another person? Uh, Patricia Margarita? Patty Marga Margarita Castellan. I don't know if she can. Hello, Patricia Margarita. Hello, yes, hello. I can't. Okay. Hi, me? Me, right? Yes. yes. Uh, I'm here. Okay, I, I can do it. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't feel so good. Uh, what's wrong? I have a stomach ache. Oh my God. Okay, so. Escucha. Yes, thank you, Patricia. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, Jose Alejandro, you want to talk? Yeah, yeah. I have time right now. Okay, okay, Alejandro. Can, can, can you put the. the, the, the... Yeah, yes, ahorita, ahorita, ahorita. Give me a second. Deme un segundo para proyectarse. Ok. No sé, se te oye bastante lejos. La, si la voz. Lejos. Ah, yeah, yeah. Ok. okay. Now. Ok. 
I don't feel well. What's wrong? I have a stressful. Oh, that's too bad. You really should should to drink some beers. Oh, <laughs> good idea. Thanks. I hope you feel better. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Tomen, representando los hombres. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. Okay, another person. Uh, eh, no sé si Sandra. Two more volunteers, and then we are going to move to the other activity. Eh, Sandra, okay. no sé. I feel terrible. Huh? Ras wrong. I have a fever. If that's too bad, you really? You should be see a doctor. Good idea. Thanks. Mm -hmm. I hope you feel better. Okay, nice, better, right? Okay, okay, fever, fever, excellent, nice, nice pronunciation. Okay, so la última persona, a volunteer for the last person. Okay, Norma, Norma Elizabeth, okay. I don't feel, I don't feel really well, but wrong, I have a back, uh, oh, that's bad. You show lie down. Good idea. Thanks. I hope you will feel better. Okay. Excellent. Nice. Very good. Nice. Thank you so much. Okay. For your homework. Okay. So we're going to continue with uh, the class. So in the manual, uh, so you have in your manual, you we have uh, the word power. You have uh, these emotions, right? Can you see them? Seven. Yeah. Okay, that's nice. Okay, I'm gonna close this. Okay, so you have these emotions. In the emotions you have here, that it's about this section. Okay, no sé qué estoy haciendo. Okay, about this section. Okay, déjeme. Mire, tengo tantas cosas abiertas que. Vaya, aquí está. Okay, y me hace con. Okay, here we go. So you have a, he looks amazed, annoyed, confused, disgusted, embarrassed, excited, excited, in, interested, interested, shock. Okay, so you have a, you in your house, you can match the faces, the different faces according with, according with this ex, facial expression, right? So you have a, do you have any question with this vocabulary? He looks amazed, annoyed, confused, disgusted, embarrassed, excited, interested, shocked. Question? What letter? Como afanado, o sea, como the F. Letter F, excited, so no, emocionado, yeah, emocionado, excited, excited. Emocionado. emocionado, okay, yeah. okay you're welcome, okay. that's nice, okay, so you, uh, in your house you can match them, como no tenemos mucho tiempo, in your house you can match uh, those vocabulary with the, with the phrase, with the faces, different faces, right, okay, so we're going to move to this conversation, uh, listen the pronunciation, you know, these highways are really great, but the road signs are pretty confusing. Mm, what do these lines on the road mean? They must mean you aren't allowed to pass here. No, I don't think so. I'm going to pass this car in front of us. In front of us. It's going to slow. It's going to slow. Now, I wonder what that sign up ahead means. It might mean you got to take a left in this lane. Or maybe it means you can turn left if you want to. I think I'll just go straight. Okay, I'm gonna choose some of you for practicing the conversation. Okay, vamos a ver. Será que Mirna Janet, can you practice the conversation with Sandra? Yes, teacher. Okay, and Sandra, right? Okay, I am key. Huh? Yes. Do you know highways? 
are really great, but the road signs are pretty confusing. Mm, what do these lines on the road mean? Road mean. They, they must mean you aren't alone. You pass here. No, I no, I don't think think so. I'm going to pass this car in front foot. O bus. I o bus. In front ah, of us. Front of us. Uh -huh. He's going to slow. No. I wonder what that saying sit up. I have means. It might mean you've got to take a left on this line. Or maybe it means you can turn left if you want to. I think I will just will go straight. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. So remember these highways, right? These highways. Great. Really great. Okay. Uh, on the road, mean. Okay. Adding aloud. Adding aloud. I don't think so. A car in front of us. Or in front of us. Okay. Eh, que solamente eso, ¿verdad? Okay. So that's very nice. Okay. Two more people, please. Eh, vamos a ver aquí qué más sale. Margarita Vigail Tobias. Are you in the class? Hello. And Geraldine. Hello. <clears throat> Okay, Margarita, you are Vicky okay. and, Ger and Geraldine is John. Okay. You know, uh, these highways are really great, but the road things are pretty confusing. Mm, what do these lines on the road mean? <clears throat> They must mean you aren't allowed to pass here. No, I don't think so. I am going to pass this car in front of us. It's going to slow. Now, I wonder what that scene up hell means. It may, it may mean you've got to die. You've got to take a left in this uh, line. Okay. Or yeah. maybe it means you can turn left if you want to. I think I just go straight. Okay, thank you. Lane, right? In this lane. Lane, porque el otro, estas son lines. Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. And the el resto está bien. Very good. Eh, no sé si ya los últimos, Juan David en Patricia Margarita. Ok. Ok, so, Juan David y John. Who am I? Vicky? Vicky. Am I Vicky? Vicky? Okay. Vicky. You know, these highways are really great, but the road signs are pretty confusing. Oh, what do these lines uh, on the road mean? They must mean you aren't allowed to pass here. No, I don't uh, think so. I am going to pass this car in front of you. Uh, it's going to slow. I wonder that uh, what that sing, sing, singing up uh, that means. It means you got a uh, left lane. Maybe. It's a maybe you can uh, turn left if you want to. I uh, I will use uh, going straight 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 it's good straight straight okay. nice okay uh the lunico signs right uh that sign up ahead means sign up ahead means right and only that okay, okay that's nice what's nice do you have any question with vocabulary or pronunciation. <laughs> Teacher, is, 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 uh, is, is equal a uh, freeway? The highway is a very big street. Yes, it's similar to freeway, but the freeway is bigger. Okay. okay. 
Okay, we're gonna I, move I, to teacher. Uh, and other and other pronunciation is in a bit uh, bitly and allowed. Allowed. It's allowed or allowed. 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 Okay. Es que como que fuera allowed. Antoja. Allowed. Okay. Allowed. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Uh, so, thanks. You're welcome. Anytime. So we have. Um, vamos a ver si me pueden escuchar este. Se mira mejor en este. Okay, leave me a few seconds. I'm going to look for the audio. Okay, no me acuerdo dónde está. Okay, here the grammar permission. I think it's this one. Y yo sigo usando el mismo reproductor. This is the problem, teacher. This is the problem. Ahorita no, no lo escucho. Nada. Se okay, quería ahorita. usar el mismo, el mismo del Windows. ¿Verdad? Sí, eh, debes ver, problema que me breakouts. Eh, ¿Cuál es? Incluso, incluso ahora con la actualización a 11 está mejorando eso bastante. Sí, ¿verdad? El de Windows. Ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. Ok, nada. No. Page 95, exercise. ¿Puede? Yes, I, I hear, I hear. Ok, that's nice, very good. Okay. Page 95, exercise 9, grammar focus. Permission, obligation and prohibition. Permission. You can camp here. You're allowed to take off your shoes. Obligation. You have to camp here. You've got to take off your shoes. Prohibition. You can't camp here. You aren't allowed to take off your shoes. That's nice. Okay, so you have a permission, obligation, and prohibition, right? So uh, you have to use for permission, can't, allowed to. For prohibition, can't, uh, or aren't allowed to, or isn't allowed to, right? And for obligation, you have to use have to or got to, right? Now, what you are going to do, you are going to match these school rules with the correct sign, okay? So you have to match numbers with different letters, right? Ok, es lo, este es lo mismo que tiene en el manual. Es la misma parte... Bueno, no, no es la misma, ¿verdad? It's not the same, but it is similar. Ok, so, but look at this. Um, ¿Quiero ver? So, give me a few seconds. Ok, aquí. Permítanme. Ok, here. This is the same that you have in your... In the platform, right? It's the same. Lock your bikes in the bike rack. What letter is this? F. Letter F. Excellent. Letter F, right? Letter F. No eating or drinking in the classroom. What letter is this? Okay. A. 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 Okay. Number three. Number three. Number three. No playing ball in the hall in the hallway. No play ball in the hallway. H. 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 Keep the classroom door closed. G. Okay. No listening to music. G. Okay. Throw trash in the waste basket. G. Uh, no cell phones. G. K. H. E. No cell phones, letter E, right? B. Eh, la de cell phones es letter E, o no? E. Okay. E. Eh, e. Yeah. Yes, you're right. Cell phone E. Turn out the lights when leaving. Turn out the lights. B. B. Letter B. Okay, letter B. These ones are similar to the ones that you have here, right? Uh, so uh, you have a playing ball, wear hard hats. Swimming aloud, drinking water, don't touch, fasten seat belts, no bicycles, and recyclable. So, uh, so no playing ball. What no? What number is? No playing balls. Uh, number eight. Number eight. Okay. Wear eight? hard hats. Eight. Eight. Wear number hard. Three. 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 Swimming. Allowed. Swimming allowed? Two. 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 Drinking water. Seven. 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 
Don't touch. Don't touch. One. 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 Number one. Okay. Fasten seat belts. Bye. 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 Okay. No bicycles. Six. Six. Uh, recyclable. Four. 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 Okay. Okay. First and seat belts was number five, right? Okay. In the platform, déjeme ver, voy a compartir lo de la platform. Um, in the platform, you have a similar exercise, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> déjeme, déjeme buscar la plataforma. Aquí está. So, in the platform, you have a, this exercise, right? So, uh, what you have to do, you have to match. Here you can larger the picture. This is the platform in the section four, right? In this part, in the before the last one, la penultima, before the last one. So you have to match the letters according with lock your vice in the by rack. So the letter F, right? The letter F. So no eating or drinking in classroom. So no drinking or eating is letter A. So according with the, so you have to choose the color letter. Este ya lo hicieron, verdad? Me imagino. Yes. Okay, that's yes. nice. Right? No. 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 <laughs> Only you. Okay. Okay, so it's according to the picture, right? Keep the classroom doors closed and you're going to look at the letter. Okay? It's clear? It's clear? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, yes, now. Yes. Now in the listening, so you are going to listen the audio. You're going to listen and you have to choose true or false. True or false, right? True or false. <laughs> Aquí las que tengo malas son false. <laughs> okay. Imagínese, imagínese, se equivoca usted, no digamos nosotros, teacher. Es que la verdad, solo, solo le, no le escuché. <laughs> solo le di true a todas. <laughs> Así le respondemos todos, teacher. Dos, tres. Ah, really? <laughs> no, ah, pues entonces, ya, pues entonces viendo, viendo las que falló, teacher, entonces es la otra respuesta. Ok, and that, that is the section number four. That's the section number four. And so we have a, in the section number five, it's about conditionals. It, that it's, uh, es lo que quiero empezar ahora, pero I need to finish the section four. No, pero escuchen, escuchen el audio. <risa> oh, sí, sí, se escucha, teacher, el audio y todo. No crea, no, no respondemos así como dice José. Ah, ah, ok, ok. Está bien, no hay problema. Es para que quede grabado. Ah, ok. So, and then we have a... Well, this one we have the unit. <risa> Who's talking? Así va a decir, Ticha. ¿Quién es? ¿Mónica? No, ¿quién es? Pero TikTok están viendo. Cabal. <risa> ok, no problem. So, la persona que tiene el estudio del micrófono creo que no se ha dado cuenta. Usted puede ver eso, Ticha, ahí en, este, en los que están conectados. Sí, pueden silenciar a todos también. ¿Cómo fue? ¿Cómo fue? Y él le hizo como que está llamando y me dice, ve. Ok. Ok. Thanks, thanks. You're welcome. So, um, so we are going to move to this, to the PowerPoint presentation. Quiero ver, permítame. Ok, so we're going to continue with the PowerPoint presentation, que usted no lo puede ver porque no se lo he compartido todavía. Aquí vamos. Ok, so... Um, we have a, a guess the gestures, right? So another activity about guessing. So we have a, the gestures and you have, um, so here you have a, a different gestures and you have to match them with, basically it's the same, the same exercise. He's biting his nails. He's rolling his eyes. He's scratching his head. He's tapping his foot. He's twirling his hair and he's wrinkling his nose. Okay, so you're gonna tell me the letter for the number one. He's biting his nails. Like this. D. Letter D. Okay, letter, letter D. Letter D. Letter D, yes. He's rolling his eyes. Letter C. C. Letter C, right? Rolling like rolling his eyes. Number three, he's scratching his head. Scratch. F. Letter F. Letter F. F. Scratch. Scratch. Rascarse. Uh, he's tapping his foot. Tapping. Tapping like this. E. Letter E. Okay. E. Letter E. He's twirling his hair like this. Letter E. 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 Letter
<laughs> yo no tengo, pero he's triple his hair. Letter A. Letter A. Letter A. A. And the last one, the number six, he's wrinkling his nose. So B. Letter B. It's like this. It's like, a, for example, when, when you don't you don't like the smell, you bring you wrinkle uh, your nose like this. Okay. Also, you have the we I have the wrinkles here, like this, like the pata de gallo. <laughs> okay. The listening lo vamos a dejar para mañana porque o oh, tal vez bueno sí sí porque ya no hay tiempo. Okay, ya solo me quedan 15 minutos. Okay, the conditionals. Can you see the presentation? Puede ver la presentación. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Now, in yes. the conditionals, in this section, we are going to review the conditional, the second conditionals. In esta sección, vamos a repasar las condicionales, los segundos condicionales. Y ya estudiaron el zero y el first. Mm. Yes. ¿De qué cómo? Yes. De los condicionales ya habían ya habían yeah. visto el zero y el first. Yes. Yes. Okay. So mm -hmm. in this section you have a the second conditional. Solo para recordarles, el zero conditional es cuando usted utiliza en una oración presente y presente, ¿verdad? If you walk out in the rain, you get wet. El primer condicional, the first conditional es cuando utiliza presente, presente y will, right? Will or want. If I exercise daily, I will become fit. Okay? Y el segundo condicional, que es el que vamos a ver en este en esta sección, es usando el pasado simple, pasado simple con el would, right? Mm -hmm. If mm -hmm. I had more free time, I would travel more. Okay? Basically, this is uh, the conditional that we're going to study in this section, in the section number five. Okay, básicamente es esto lo que vamos a estudiar en esta sección 5, porque ya estudiaron el zero y el first conditional, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. okay. okay, so, no, so, so as, lo único que se tiene que recordar es que en el segundo condicional va pasado simple y va el will más el verbo. Ok, ¿es clear? Can you, share, can you share this in, in the WhatsApp group? Yes, yeah, sure, sure. Please. Yes, I'm going to share it. No problem. Aquí yo creo que está bien resumido, ¿verdad? Bien, bien, bien. Está un poco más explicado. Entonces, so in the second conditional, so we have a the past simple and the word, right? If I have more free time, si yo tuviera más tiempo libre, coma, yo viajaría más. Ahora bien, usted no puede empezar la cláusula. Ok, tenemos dos oraciones y a estas oraciones se le llama cláusulas. Ok, clauses, right? You have a two clauses. Tenemos dos oraciones, dos cláusulas. Ah, oh, bien. Eh, cuando usted tiene eh, este lado, el if, con el if, usted no puede utilizar el would. Jamás, jamás, jamás. ¿Por qué? No sé. Pero nadie puede utilizar. Eh, o sea, ya es regla. Ya es regla que usted no puede poner aquí. If I will more free time. Incluso suena raro. Ok. If I will more free time, uh -huh. I have travel more. No, no se puede. Si yo tuviera más tiempo, yo haría esto. O sea, que tenemos la condicional aquí, esta condicional, y tenemos en la otra cláusula que es el resultado. Este es condition, este es result. Condition, result. Entonces, si yo, en pasado simple, el complemento, yo haría esto, ¿verdad? Entonces, <coughs> quiero ver qué más. Ah, podemos poner, por ejemplo, eh, podemos empezar la condicional de con este lado, o sea, la segunda parte, I will travel more, coma, if I had more... If I had more free time, ¿verdad? Las podemos invertir. Eso sí podemos hacer. Las podemos invertir, pero con if nunca podemos utilizar would, ¿verdad? Never, never of the never. ¿Es clear? Yes. Ok. Yes. ¿Questions? ¿Do you have questions? No. No questions. No ok. Questions. La tercera condicional todavía no se la voy a explicar porque todavía no va a hacer que se confundan un poquito más. Eh, mm -hmm. So, uh, in, the, in the platform, en la plataforma creo que hay un ejercicio de esto, ¿verdad? Pero quiero ver si aquí, ok, for example, here you have, a, the, in the grammar focus, you have unreal conditional sentences, lo que les estaba explicando, with it clauses. Unreal conditional sentences describe imaginary situations in consequences in the present, ¿verdad? Ok, o sea que esto, este condicional describe 
situaciones imaginarias y consecuencias en el presente, pero son cosas que no pasan, sino que se, son imaginarias o son situaciones uh, que tienen consecuencias, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, what would you do if you found eh, $750,000? Ok, sí estoy grabando, ¿verdad? <laughs> we travel around the world. Ok, yeah, yeah. so it's a imaginary situation, right? With simple yes. past form and imaginary consequence, the result, imaginary consequence with models, who, my, or who. Entonces, aquí es, en el Grammar Focus nos está diciendo que aparte de who, podemos utilizar might y podemos utilizar who, ¿verdad? Aquí ya, ya nos están enredando más. Por eso eh, les, les presenté esa imagen que siento que está bien fácil de... de, de está muy simplificada. Sí. Ajá, exacto. Entonces, Por ejemplo, sí. una oración imaginaria podría ser, teacher, si yo tuviera novia, eh, podría pasar acompañado en Navidad. Ok, ok, that's nice. Very good. Ah, pues consiga una. Ok. Es imaginario nice. eso, Ticho, es imaginario. Ah, ok, ok. Ah, so it's not real. Ok, so I'm sending you the, the picture in, to the WhatsApp group. Solo que me está Ahora costando. Ahora que, que lo diga en inglés. Ahora que lo diga en inglés. Ah, good, ok. <laughs> ok. He's proud, he's proud. How, do, how would you say that? ¿Cómo dirían lo que dijo David en inglés? Si yo tuviera novia. If no I puedo. had girlfriend. Ok, if I had girlfriend. Uh -huh. I will uh, share my time Christmas with her. Uh -huh. I will pass I will Christmas with her. I will, or, I, will, or, I, will, I will. Or spend my time. Yeah. I, I will could. spend my time. Uh -huh. with you have different, different options, ¿verdad? Entonces aquí como usted puede ver, tenemos diferentes Opciones, would, might, who, would, right? Would o wouldn't. Entonces, dependiendo de la situación. Para mañana, este, le voy a dejar de tarea esta parte, la parte A. ¿Qué es lo que tiene que hacer? Usted tiene que unir, you have to match the clauses A with the results, with the consequence, with the letter B. ¿Ok? Usted tiene que unirlas. ¿Ok? In your notebook. Ahí solamente, ok, la number one, eh, eh, C or D. Number two, A or B. And number three, G or H. This one is going to be for tomorrow. It's on page 28. Esto es la tarea de mañana, en la página 28. ¿Es clear? Uh, clear, teacher. Page okay. 28. Es la 28. Teacher, could, yes? could you give us an example with might? With oh, might, word. of course. For example, if yeah. I um, might. let me see. Okay, if I have uh, if I have the newest car, I might go mm -hmm. to more places in El Salvador. Mm -hmm. So it's in the imaginary situation, right? And in the imaginary consequence. Another example, mm -hmm. it could be, for example, if I have a yacht, if I have a boat. Si yo tuviera un bote, un yate, a yacht, if I had a yacht, yeah. I might go to La Libertad, to Liberty Port, to the harbor. Mm -hmm. Is clear? So, so my means the same than, than would or could? Uh, but the, the same? Remember that my is possibility. Might is possibility. Could is yes. ability. Uh -huh. And would is like oh, a yeah. desire, it's a wish. Uh -huh. Eh, sí, de verdad que les pasé esta tablita. No sé si la han revisado. Espérenme, déjenme ver. Tengan un poquito de paciencia que no me puedo mover tan rápido. Ok, recordemos que eh, can, Q para habilidad. Present and past, right? La ven la tabla. Can you see them? Can you see it? No, I cannot share. Ah, ok, I'm going to share it. Okay, ahorita antes de terminar. Espérenme. Okay. Vamos a ver aquí. Here we go. Ok, ahora sí, ver. Now, yes. Now, remember, if uh, so you have any doubt about the models, you have any question about the models, so remember to, you can use this PDF. Si tiene yes. algún, eh, una duda con el uso de los modales todavía, usted puede ver la tablita que le mandé al, allí al, al WhatsApp, the PDF that you have in WhatsApp. I'm going to send it again. La voy a enviar, reenviar. 
Okay, so remember that, uh, so according with the different, different what? Different uses, uh, you have to, ahí la, la acabo de reenviar ahorita. According with the different uses, okay, according with the different uses, uh, you have uh, the models for ability, for possibility, for permission, for request, for obligation, en obligación solo tenemos más y have to, nada más. For lack of obligation, por falta de obligación, usamos don't have to or needn't, right? Deduction, conclusion, prohibition, advice, tenemos varios. Offer, shall and will. Suggestion, shall, would and should, right? Recordando que shall solo lo podemos utilizar con yo y con we, ¿verdad? Pero es, lo, es el mismo will, pero solo es más formal pero solamente es con I con we, y con we, ¿ok? Ok, regresando, uh, ok, we are going to come back to the PDF about your manuals, and, quiero ver, about the might, ok, déjeme, déjeme share the screen, que tengo que estar cambiando de screen, so, uh, the might is a possibility, for example, use, if you see the clouds and it's dark, you can say, it might rain, podría llover. Si usted ve las nubes oscuras, eh, usted dice, it might rain, podría llover. Pero no es que, no es que vaya, pas hay posibilidad que pase o que no pase, ¿verdad? En cambio con who, es, um, es como un deseo, ¿verdad? Yo lo regresaría rápido. Si me encontrara el dinero, yo lo regresaría, yo no lo regresaría rápido, dice Ok, o yo iría rápido a la policía. I will go straight to the police. Ok, um, so this one is like a, a desire or a wish that you have using will. And my is a possibility. Are you, will, using, are you using will as um, an auxiliary? No, as a moral. In this case, as, as morals. Moral. En este yeah. tiempo, ajá, como en la sección 4 vimos los modales, como en este se utiliza como un modal. Y recordando que con los modales, el verbo no se le agrega S, ni S, ni aunque esté utilizando he o she. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué, ¿Les quedó más claro o lo confundí más? <risa> no, no, quedó más claro, teacher. Ah, ok. okay. So, solo hay que recordar que might es posibilidad. Wu es como expresar un deseo. Y cool es podrías, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. okay. So you have a simple past, if I found, right, if I found this money, I wouldn't return it so fast. If I found this money, I might go to Las Vegas. If I found this money, I could double it in a casino. <laughs> if I found this money, I would go straight to the police. Questions so far? Okay. Questions? Questions? Tiene preguntas? Me escuchan? Hello? 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 Lo escuchamos. Ah, ok. ¿Tiene sí, preguntas? Lo escuchamos, con, con... Sí, ah, va. Todo bien. Ok. Entonces, con el Unreal Conditional, el, el segundo condicional, el Unreal Conditional, ¿tiene preguntas? Eh, como vamos a hacer este ejercicio en la casa, ¿verdad? Porque no, ya no hay tiempo, ya solo tres minutos tengo. Eh, so, um, uh, we are going to listen this the part. Attendance. No, pasar lista. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Como estaba preocupado por lo del internet, eh, no me acordé. Okay, uh, Ana y Amilet. Present? Oh, she asked for permission. No me acuerdo qué es. Eh, quiero ver. Ana, no sé si me pidió permiso allí. Ana, Ana, déjeme ver. Okay, um, okay. Uh, Carlos José Asensio asked for permission because has problem with the blizzard. Con el, con la, con el viento tuvo problemas. Stephanie Saray, present. Present, sure. Geraldine, present, right? Okay, Ingrid Maricela. Present. Ir, Irma Adriana Segura. Hello, Irma. Irma, Irma. Ah, creo que In me mandaron. Chat, you're so present. Ah, yes, thank you. Thank you, Irma. Eh, Joana Michel Cetino. Present. Okay. Uh, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Yes, right. It's, it's working, but it's present. Present, teacher. Okay. Juan David. I'm present. present. Right? Okay. Juan David. Okay. Present. Present, teacher. Carla Melissa Coloche. Present, right? 
here. Okay, excellent. Eh, Kevin Josías Flores. Kevin Josías, no, ¿verdad? No le he visto. Hoy no le he visto. Sinceramente no le he visto. Okay, so, uh, okay, uh, another person. Lucía Elena present, right? Hello, Lucía Elena. Hello, hello. Okay, al uh, siguiente, me quiero ver. Margarita Abigail Tobías. Present. Hello. Okay, Maritza Elizabeth. Present. Okay, uh, Mary Daniela. Present teacher. Okay, Milagro de la right? Mirna Janet. Present, present. Okay, Mirna. Present. Okay, Mónica Daniela. Monique? Present, teacher. Okay, Nelson Adam, yes, it's working, right? Uh, Norma Elizabeth Lizano. Norma? Norma, Norma Elizabeth Lizano? No. Ah, yes, yes, right? Okay, Patricia Esmeralda. Present. Okay, Patricia Margarita Castellanos. Present, teacher. Okay, Ronald, present. Sí estaba, ¿verdad? En la clase, ¿verdad? Sandra Elizabeth. Sí, decía que estaba ocupado. Ok. Ah, ya. Yeah. Ok, thank you, Sandra. Y Estefania Abigail Quintanilla. Y Ana Yamilet, no se fijaron si repuso por ahí. Ana Yamilet. Me acuerdo cómo. Ah, sí, 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 sí. Ya. Yeah. He's driving, she said. Ok, so. So, so for tomorrow, we are going to have is this homework, right? The homework that I tell you is to match, uh, to match this. Oh no, este está más difícil el, el que les, en esta versión del libro. Okay, so you have to match this one, column A with column B. Tiene que unir las columnas A con las columnas B. Recordando que esta es la condición y este es el resultado o la consecuencia. Ambos son imaginarios, ambos son situaciones imaginarias, porque el segundo condicional se le llama Unreal conditional, right? Unreal conditional. So um, that's it. So see you tomorrow. Uh, so, so, so what, what page did you say that uh, is? 28. It? Página 28. 28, okay. 28. 28. Okay. Thank you. Gracias. Okay. Children. Okay, see you Bye. tomorrow. Thank you, teacher. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Good night. Have a good night. Have a good night. Take care. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye -bye. Bye -bye.